Hi guys, um, today's tutorial is uh, just, uh, I wanted to play around with my um, bitch slap stuff. So I just did like, um, just pinks and different kind of hues of pinks and a little bit of uh, black. And I did some lines, so yeah. I think, I forgot who who asked me to do the swatches, I'll put the name right here. But um, I have a, quite a few Medusa Makeup um, eyeshadows, eye dusts. So I'm going to uh, swatch them for you. And I have something to say. I love this company. I think the names are so hilarious and they're so cute. They're all mineral eyeshadows and they're very, very highly pigmented. They're beautiful colors. And you get a pretty good amount of color. I mean, you know, p uh, product. But on, on the other hand, I do not like the eyeshadows. I have a few of these, um, the ones in the pot form. Like this one's called, it looks so beautiful, doesn't it? It's called Electric Kiwi. And they are so chalky. And I'm digging. I am really getting in there with that. And that's all you get. All you can have is like a sh little sheen of glitter. I do not like these eyeshadows. So um, on my hand, all I did was take a little bit of Too Faced Shadow Insurance and I placed it all over my hand. I'm going to start off with, um, this is an eye dust called Blue Balls. I'm just going to do some figure swatches on there for you. I'll just grab about that much. And that's Blue Balls. This one is called Coral Reef, like that. Coral Reef. Boilant Green, looks like that. Just soily, so. This one is in Purple Rain, looks like that. It's one of my favorite ones. Uh, purple rain. This one is in tiger. Tiger. Red baron. Looks like that. This one is in magma. Right there. My camera's not even do these justice. I mean, like this, these are beautiful, highly, highly pigmented. And I have a, on my list of the seller that I buy from, I bought all these from the same seller and she is so quick. I will place my order and I will get all of my, my eyeshadows within like two days. Perfect, she's a great seller. Um, this one is in Flamingo. Pretty, um, right there, Flamingo. This is in Big Bird. I use this one quite a lot. Big word. Auto. Silver auto. And my last one is in Black Sabbath. It's a matte, matte black. And Black Sabbath. So these are all the um, eyeshadows I have from her. I have all, look how highly pigmented those are. That's beautiful. And they're relatively cheap. They're gorgeous. I have no complaints about these, but the, like, um, the eyeshadows, I don't think I'm going to be getting any more of those because they're chalky and I do not like those. But I hope you guys enjoyed my tutorial. I have apparently paint pot all over my eye, and now I'm going to, uh, yeah, NYX Jumbo Pencil in Milk and place that on my brow bone. And I'm taking NYX Jumbo Pencil in Hot Pink. I'm going to put this all over my lid. Take um, a small eyeshadow brush. Like so. With this color from the Shimmer 88 palette. This really frosty, light pinky color right there. I'm gonna place it in my tear duct area. Next I'm taking Fake Bitch by Bitch Slap Cosmetics. Very bright, vibrant um, pink. With my 239 brush, I'm going to place it all over the uh, lid area. I'm going to do some makeup brush with this red from the Crazy Bitch um, palette. I'm going to pack that on to the outer corner of my eye and bring it in. So I'm going to take a. Um, 
a blending brush. This one is from Sonia Kashuk. I'm going to blend all this color up a little bit. Now I'm going to take an angled, a slanted brush, eyeshadow brush, like that with the black from the um, matte 88 palette. And I'm going to make a V in my outer corner. Take um, a small buff contour brush. I'm going to dip into that to this color from the matte 88 palette. That one. Oh god! That one. I'm gonna blend down the pink. Put up that frosty white. Um, not frosty. It's, I think it's matte. Yeah, the matte right, white right here from the um palette. I'm gonna apply it over top of that color. Take another small eyeshadow brush. I'm going to use this light pink color right here from the Crazy Bitch palette. I'm going to go over top of the um, where the highlight color and the pink meet. Just going to help it smooth out the transition a little bit. And once you have that finished, I'm going to take that same Malibu pencil and apply a little bit on top of the pink. a small concealer brush with this um, pink glitter. Just press a little bit on top of the, um, the pink. Alright, I'm going to remove my tape. And then I'm going to take that same really light um, color that I used for the inner horn uh, corner highlight. Pinky, silvery color, white color. I'm going to apply it underneath my eye in my tear duct area. Then I'm going to take this, oh, this is my favorite song off the CD. I'm going to take a little bit of NYX Jumbo Pencil. Spread it out. And go over my lower lash line. So. All right, I'm going to take that, um, pinky color that I used to blend out the pink on the top. I'm going to blend out from the Crazy Bitch palette. I'm going to blend out the um, pink. Big bitch. Take my engraved pencil and line my lower lash line. Here are the eyes. Add some more dots. Kind of went on like a pattern down my eyebrow. Woo! Alright, guys, and for my um, blush today, I contoured with my um, Sculpting Shape Powder from MAC. Um, for blush, I actually just used, um, I didn't have like a bright hot pink like blush, or, like baby pink blush, so I used my 30 big um, eyeshadow palette from um, eBay. I used that one. And I used that for a blush today. For my lips, I'm going to do a pale pink color, I guess. I'm going to line my lips with a flower lip liner. Okay. Use um, Creme de Nude by um, Mac. All right, and on top of that, I'm going to place a little bit of Love Nectar.
And that is it for my tutorial, guys.